Hey everyone, welcome back. My name is Kyle Denton with Bullion RV here in Duluth, Minnesota. And today we have for you the 2021 Leprechaun by Coachman. It's a C-Class. We'll get you around the outside, we'll bring you on the inside, we'll see what you think. All right, we'll let you look up front. Right above the cab, you got the nice front cap with the LED and the nice window on there. This one is going to be a 450. It was a 7.3 liter. Up here, you have the nice, beautiful awning. We got it in the inside in the garage in the bay, so you can see all the shade that's bringing down under it. Just imagine the sun beating down of all the shade it's going to bring you at the campsite. It's going to be really nice. We'll start off right up front here. With down here, you can see your side camera which is really nice because if you got these big mirrors which is beautiful but if you take one of these off in a toll booth on your travels if you forget to tuck it in or if it's too tight one of those break off you still have your side camera just to keep you going we'll bring you in the front door and show you the easy step up you got the two steps you got a nice one big step here with the grip tape and another step to bring you right in with the handle to pull you right in. So this is nice, easy access in there. Gets you really comfortable. You don't gotta pick your leg up too high. It's nice design there. Now I want you to keep in mind the nice light beige color that's on here. So when you are traveling down the road and putting on a lot of miles, you don't gotta worry about it getting dirty and feeling like you need to wash it all the time. It's really gonna hide all that dust and grime too for you, which is really nice. Down here, you got your LP tank with your furnace exhaust. Down here you get some little bit of storage. It's a little dark like I said with that awning, it really brings that shade so it kind of darks it on this side. Beautiful LED that runs the whole way with your nice big windows. You do have an outdoor television set which has got a sound bar on the bottom to make that nice sound kind of echo through the campsite for you. Nobody wants to turn their TV up to full blast. Doesn't sound good. This one is the 298 KV. Does have the Asdell, which is a nice composite under it, under the fiberglass, moisture resistant. All right, we'll bring you around. Keep us going. Another window in the back. Right here, you got the 110 power. Like I said, you put your put a table out here, get a griddle going, cook some breakfast. Move you down here in the pass-through storage. You can see the light on the other side. Tuck it in. Bring you around to the back side. Back it up, give you a good view of it. You got your nice bumper. It's gonna hide your sewer um, sewer tubes. Up top, you got your backup camera. And a nice walkable ladder to the roof. This one's nice because it wraps all the way to the top. Some of them just stop. This one has the bars on top to really pull you up to the top, make you feel secure. Bring it on this side. We got a couple more little storage units on the bottom of here. And a nice big one on this side with a nice light. It's gonna be great for at night. If you get to the campsite late and you wanna un unpack stuff, you do have the light in there. Down here you got your tank dumps. And this one does have two slides on the unit. And it has awnings above for that extra protection on both of them. Walk you around the side here. You got your outdoor shower. Great feature. Just brings that second shower unit to the to the campgrounds to shower off all the kids, the dogs, the toys. You can spray anything down from the outside. It's really nice. Leave the dirt out there. If you were like my mom, she'd make me take a hose shower before I could take a real shower because of how dirty we got. Water hookups. You got a cable on this side. More storage under here that runs under both the, under the slide. Bring it around. You got lights up on that bunk up top. 
to bring in all the natural lighting. And again, the dual step for you on both sides. And usually just the passenger side has the grip. This one has the handle as well, which is really nice. As you can see, I got the seats turned around to show you how you can add more space into there. So we'll get you in there soon. One more look from out here. All right, let's get you in the inside. Right away, I want to show you when you're, when you're walking in on the steps, you do have your battery access right there. And then a nice little kick storage for the shoes right as you walk in so you can get those things off and not tracking dirt everywhere. Also, you do have a latch for the for the baby. You can latch them down. Nice secure area right there. Also by the front door has all your patio lights, your interior lights, everything's right here, your awning, your battery disconnect, it's all right by the front door. Which also has a nice big grab handle to pull you up and in. Alright. Right away as you walk in, you have the dinette table with the wraparound booth and the table. Which is going to fold down into a sleeping area for you. Right across you have your chairs, reclining chairs, that sit right across from your entertainment system. So you got a nice big TV up there with a Blu-ray and DVD CD player going on right there. Right next to you got your HDMI hookups and more USB and kind of a little cubby to tuck some stuff with cabinets to the side of the TV as well. We'll put this down. You got a vent up here and a fan vent. And then you do have this nice bunk area up here. Now this is where the kids are gonna live. Sleep up here, they're gonna love it. They can see out the front cap, they got the side windows. There's reading lights on both sides. There's gonna be a ladder that'll get you up and in there. It's really great. Like I said, these are the chairs that swivel around so you can turn this living space into a really comfortable area and really bring the whole family in. Nice touch screen on the front. And we'll turn you around and show you the chairs again. Above the chairs, you got a lighted compartment area, which is super great. Not often do you find lights in the compartment areas, so that's a nice little feature there. Move you into the kitchen. Nice big fridge and freezer. So when you're bringing the family, come to the one-stop shop and get everything you need to go for the trip. You don't gotta keep running in. Nice little dry storage above it. Great convection microwave in this unit here. It's really nice to have one of those. Big deep. You know, sometimes these ovens get a little small, so kind of have a second oven and the unit is really nice. This one does have a three burner cooktop. Kind of snag that one. Show you that. And then it does come with some really cool accent lights on there as well. So you can just turn those on. Those are really nice. It does have an LP detector so you feel safe storage under for all the pots and pans nice deep drawer there and you got storage next to it with cool pull out drawers kind of little hidden pocket stuff and pull all those out and then under the sink as well it's got some more good storage under there too now this one does have the pull out faucet sprayer seems like everybody's doing that now everywhere you go it's got the built-in one which is a great feature with a dual sink and then this does have the big compartment that goes over the top and turns your space into just more and more counter space when you don't need the sink and then if you do you get this on the side to add to it as well all right 
right, you got your AC unit right there. And we'll bring you around back into the bedroom. And right here you got all your tanks. You got your electric water heater, heated tanks, the area for your slides. And then I would use this for a pantry. This is a nice area to store a bunch of extra food in here. It does have some 110 in case you need some power. We're gonna bring you back in the kitchen. One cool option is that I almost skipped past. You have this little pop down, pop up, USB 110 little unit right here, which is really cool. Kind of just hide away extra power for you. All right, we'll bring in the big bedroom. Now it's really rare, this is a king size bed. It's really rare to see a king size bed in a coach this size in a C-Class, but they have one in here for you. When they got 110 on both sides, which is awesome. Storage up above the bed with the reading lights, all those cabinets there. And a nice big wardrobe storage here with the sliding glass doors with the hanging bar and then storage above it. Power down here for the CPAP machine if you need one. And more storage here for you as well. All these drawers are going to pull out. Really great. This bedroom does have a fan into it as well for ventilation. And then it does have an area for a TV with the 110 and the cable. And it is prepped for a washer and dryer unit all in one if you want. Otherwise, you can just use it for more storage, you know? That's another great big area here. We'll bring it into the bathroom. So, first thing, porcelain toilet. Always a win. Easy cleanup, feel safe and sturdy on those guys. You do have a huge storage behind the toilet for all your towels. Anything extra that you need that you need more space for is just right here. And you do have your towel hooks to the side. And then a little medicine cabinet up above the window in the bathroom, which is really nice too. Put that in there. Nice little sink area. With the little storage underneath it. And then you got your at your shower you got a nice light in the shower to keep it going you do have a little dome sky dome which will bring some more light in and give you that extra head space which is really nice to have in something like this for me personally I don't have to worry about it but I have lots of friends and family who are a lot taller and you know that could be a make or break for you and this one really really gives you that option to have it which is which is really nice All right, I'll give you one more pan of the bedroom here. Like I said, this is a big bedroom with the king size bed that you don't often see. So that's a nice quality to have in here. Bring it around into the living space. The kitchen. And up front, I'm gonna sit down in the captain's chair. Like I said, my name is Kyle Dibber. I'm here with Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. You can call or text me anytime at 320-290-5834. And remember, Bullion is your one-stop RV dealer for any of your RV needs. It's been family owned and operated for over 60 years. Remember, happy camping.